that it you know it comes out with the bell bottom and I could dimension that wherever I want but I'm just gonna you know for the sake of time just add a break here pull that out I'll just get this down to here and I'll pull this up that's the shape of my footing now what I could do is I could I could have you know on the floor plan you're gonna look at a circle and that's gonna be your footing and in 3d you want to show a post footing what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna make this a half inch let me just show you what I got here so that's gonna be basically the outline of my footing now I'm not gonna bother you know doing it half inch all the way down I just want it to look right on on the outside you know I've drawn the back side of this object toward the middle of this you know toward the left I'm going to click on that and I'm going to transform rep I'm sorry I'm going to add that to a library and it's going to look like this in my library now I can attach that to any CAD item I want and again I'll go in here and re rename this I'll call it my footing and close that let's go draw a circle and I could make this circle maybe I want to have a 10 inch footing so I'm gonna make the diameter of that 10 inches actually I should probably make about well, 10 inches will work so there's my footing circle now I'm gonna convert that and attach the shape to that circle so I'm going to convert that using my convert tool here and I'm going to convert that to a molding polyline not a 3D just a molding polyline big difference and then I'm gonna say well what do I want to put on that circle what do I want to attach to it what did I draw that or what's in the library can I attach to that circle let's hit add new let's go to my import library where I just put that let's get my footing let's click OK there it is it's 48 inches tall the width of the thing that's being attached to the circle is five and a half that's fine and I want the um, I want that to be on the outside of my circle again click OK and there's my footing let's take a look at that in 3D that's what I just created right there my footing tube so the, the CAD circle is right here and the shape that I drew is attached to the outside of it. It's going around the outside. And there's so many places you can use this. <clears throat> Let's go turn off this ceiling inside. Remember I named it 3D slab beams. I'll turn it off here. And you know what? I'm going to go into my overview and it's off there already. Let's just take a quick look at some of the things you can do with these molding polylines <clears throat> and